Welcome to Drinks Made Easy. I'm Frank. And I'm Ron. We decided to drop by from Harlan County to give the YouTube viewership boost to Drinks Made Easy because of our newfound celebrity. Now, Earl, I hear you got a beef with a certain politician. I do. Hillary Rodham Clinton just used her own personal email to everything up. There have been seven congressional hearings about it. Well, whatever. She used her emails, caused the ambassador to die, and then the SEALs from SEAL Team 6 just couldn't get there in time yeah, from Lebanon they, to get there, and so... They God. weren't SEAL Team 6, folks. You don't let me tell my story. Go this ahead. is America, where what you say is right because you're Americans. So how do we make this Benghazi Fubar? All right, the Benghazi Fubar is made by putting an ounce of one fifth, no, uh, hold on, I got sh You put three quarters of an ounce yeah, that's right. Of peppermint schnapps yep. in a shot glass, right, right, right there. Right. And then you put another three quarters that's of right. an ounce yeah. of Southern Comfort. You, you know, it might be made in China. Nope, not. Okay. No. Well, good. At least something's not made in China. Now, then what you got to do? Pick it up. All right. You got to give a little bit of float, a 151, because much like Benghazi was foobar because it got set on fire, you're gonna set this on fire. And one for you, one for me. Now we're gonna set it on fire. Yeah, I'm gonna put that down. I don't want any fire in my hands. What? And how much beer you got in there? Oh, uh, six yeah. ounces of beer. What kind of beer? Budweiser. The only wait, which oh that the only beer you should use. All right. Now you're gonna set it on fire. Now you might have to, you know, layer it on with a spoon, make sure there's enough of the 151 on top it doesn't sink all the way down. You got, uh, I'm sorry, I'm just trying to help people at home. Hey man, shit. All right, now what you want to do though, because you can't see much, is you got to make sure that it's on fire. You'll feel the heat. Yeah. All right. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Paul ain't gonna like that. I don't care. Paul ain't here. All right. Drop it in. Watch your hands. Go. How was it? Oh shit, that's hot. Oh. Yeah, yeah, it's glass on fire, buddy. Ah. Oh yeah. So you're saying you had some new thing and everything? You get everything off your chest? No, I want to take this country back and make this country great again. All right, like when? Before Obama. So like when unemployment was at a 30 year high? Talking about when like we were standing recession. up to the world and fighting against Muslims. Like two wars that were bankrupting the country and causing thousands of our men and women to be killed and maimed? Before there was, you had to have health care because it's your right to be unhealthy. Yeah, you couldn't get health insurance before universal health care. Oh, shut up! Can I just please want my country back? But when? When are you talking about? What, what time are you talking about? Well, when my dad was born. Your dad was born in 1945. Exactly. 